This is me, softly touching your face, pulling you in for a long, slow kiss. And this is me kissing you back, running my hands through your hair. Best handshake ever. So, we'll talk tonight? I can't wait. Okay, fine. Do you really want to see me in one of my old costumes? Yes, please. Then you have to promise that you're going to watch a Nebula 9 marathon with me. And? No making fun. You try the hard bargain, but okay. I'll see you at your place. Tell me something, Castle. Why did he let you live? To punish me. Make me pay for ruining his plan. Now he's gonna kill again all because I couldn't stop him. And I feel so... I know the feeling. I know you do. For an even greater role came my way. A part, perhaps the greatest role that I have ever played. That of mother. That's sweet. You're right, that is sweet. Shh. Sorry. Now, if Richard had only been able to embrace the role of son with the same level of commitment, and into the woods we go. Thank you. Did you get any sleep? Not much. Anything new on our victim? We rechecked Orlando's rap sheet. Montgomery wasn't involved in any of his old arrests. That break-in wasn't personal. What about the call he made before he was killed? It's from a burner phone. There's no registered owner. Hey. You're not in this alone. I'm here. I know. I'm not going to deny that I brought other women up here. But, um, none of them were you. You want to um, go and check out that pool? Yeah. <laughs> 
You know, I still remember. When Alexis was born, they handed me this tiny person all bundled up. She just stared up at me. And when I looked down at her, this feeling hit me. Like I've been struck by lightning. It's love. That instant, inexplicable love you can only feel for your child. In that moment, I knew. I knew my life had changed forever. She sounded so scared. Could hurt in her voice just like when she was a little girl. There was nothing I could do. She wasn't hurt, Castle. That's what matters. That's what we hold on to. I just want her home. We're not giving up yet. Maybe it'll be better. And this way, when we come home at the end of each day, we'll have something to talk about, like normal couples. Only your day will be classified. We're gonna make this work, I promise. I'll have a couple of days off after this case, and, and we'll figure it out, but until then... You to say it. I'll be on the first flight out in the morning. Beckett, finally. What's going on? Why won't anyone talk to me? And why would they take my blood? Castle, you know that case that I've been investigating, the, um, the break-in and the theft? Well, it turns out there's more to it than we thought. Are you going to waterboard me? Because that would seriously affect our relationship. No, babe, can, can you listen for a second? Sometimes... The hardest things in life are the things most worth doing. Just because we haven't figured it out yet doesn't mean we won't. Tell you what, though. Next time I say I'm dying to see you, let's keep it metaphoric. Yeah. Hmm. Playing the anonymous source card? I mean, that is pure genius. It, it actually makes me love you more. Well, she's filing for asylum in the State Department. It's gonna help relocate her, so... Hopefully that'll keep her safe. Yeah, but even working for the feds, you... You found the ultimate way to honor the victim. Charlie died trying to get Svetlana away from her dangerous family. You completed his mission. Yeah, but you would have done the same thing, Castle. Yes. Yes, and I would love me more for doing it, too. Kate, would you, um, would you go to the dance with me? It's weird. Before I saw that, all I wanted to know was where I was and what I was doing. Now, I am not so sure. There's no music. As the sun set on the mean streets of the naked city, I could feel my luck was about to change. 
The killer was caught, my case was closed, and hanging on my arm was the dame of my dreams. <sighs> Are you gonna be doing that all night? Not if it hurts my chances. We need to talk to her. Castle, I don't have any jurisdiction. This isn't my case. Yes, but it's my case. Eva hired me. She was my friend, and he killed her right in front of me. <sighs> okay. I'll talk to the mistress. But just me. Not you. You're too close to this. divorce lawyer's office I was watching. Why, Captain Beckett, I had no idea. I feel so violated. <laughs> Look, I know you were just playing a role, but... When she asked you if there was any hope for us and you didn't say anything, I was... Kate. I have never given up hope. Not since the day we met. And that'll never change until you tell me it should. And then don't change. Ever. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Where have to go? I guess the timeout's over. Your sexy Russian lover? Correction, my sexy Russian lover who happens to be a model. Oh. Good deal. Come on. Dr. Livingstone, I presume. Couldn't find my piss helmet, so. Go. Appearing and disappearing at will. Being both deceptive and helpful. The mystery blonde is Lars Ronin Genie, wandering the earth, waiting for someone to find her lamp. She's chosen to appear to me. That's it. I'm cutting you off. No, 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 no. no. She's, she's giving me clues, Becca. She wants me to find the lamp. I think she wants me to be her new master. And you know what I think? You need to call me the next time you see her so I can question her. I gotta come up with a wish list. Oh my god, I have so many. How am I gonna whittle it down to three? That's funny, I just have one. What's that? Then my man would stop talking about being some skeezy blonde's master and would start talking about taking his wife to bed. Oh. Well, I don't need a genie to grant that wish. <laughs> oh. I feel like I could sleep for a week. How about some breakfast first? Best way to start off a hibernation. Uh, you know what? Why don't we just order in? You don't have to cook. I love cooking for you. And I love when you cook for me. I'm going to go change. All right. Uh, go to dinner. Do you brief each other? Why, Castle? So I can be another one of your conquests? Or I could be one of yours. It's nice to meet you, Castle. It's too bad. It would have been great. You have no idea. Every writer needs inspiration, and I found mine. Always. Always. <laughs> 